Hey guys, so today I want to take a quick look here at the um, Zenfone 3 Max and it's uh, Zen UI over here. So let's take a quick look at it here. So the one thing that I have noticed with the Zen UI is that uh, it's very nice because Asus has a ton of apps uh, which seems to be updated and kind of like high quality from the start. Uh, with all of those useful things uh, that you may want to use. It really seems like they care about creating a quality experience. So this phone comes with Android 6.0, uh, which is nice. You do have the Zen UI instant updates over here, uh, where you can see all of the uh, Asus apps and how you can just install the latest one with the Zen UI launcher over here. I'm not sure, am I running on it right now? I think so, but uh, I haven't connected this one right now to uh, the internet. But as you can see, folders, for example, it's very nice how it pops up full screen. Uh, on many other phones, it doesn't do that. So I think that's a little bit creative how they have made that. Uh, so let's just see how um, multitasking looks like. So very, very fast and smooth performance feels very very uh, much optimized if i hold in here on the screen very very nice how it pops up here home edit wallpapers uh, send ui theme and you do have some stock wallpapers over here if i just try this one home and lock screen hit apply you can also select a kind of like cool transparent effect over there, uh, which is nice if I fire up the camera pretty fast. Skip. No, thanks. Good fast focus. Feels very fresh to take photos. And you do have a bunch of different uh, stock modes over there to do a uh, bunch of different things. If I check out the keyboard here, the stock keyboard, you can see that you do have the things that you want, like uh, emojis, uh, which I think is the stock Google emojis. So nothing super fancy over there, but still uh, pretty, pretty nice. Uh, you also do have some kind of voice assistant. Cats, cats. Cats, cast, okay, maybe it's not the perfect. Let's see how the lock screen looks like. Very, very clean. And uh, if I hold in the power screen here, it looks very, very basic. So yeah, just a quick look here at the UI on this little phone. Oh, wow. Okay, so you can both hold in like this. If you just hold in, then that screen pops up. But if you swipe like this, there is another screen pops up so you can change, uh, for example, the, uh, the effects when you change pages, home screens and stuff like that. So that is very, very nice how they have two different uh, modes there. So yeah, quick look at it. Hopefully you enjoyed. Let me know what you want to see more specific. And if you want to check out the price on this phone, I will leave that in the description down below.